thank God that the brothers on the rise now. Endless celebrations all in my house. Levitating now, I'm super duper fly now. And I believe it was about it. Yeah, so do I. Completely agree. Uh, it's very smart yeah. play from Pogba. Yeah. Yeah. He knew, he knew what he was doing. Mm -hmm. And I, don't, I can't see an issue. I can't see an issue with trying to go for a penalty. Mm. And, and um, not long after, where Luke Shaw could have gone down, and Pogba's there shouting at him, saying, "You need to start going down in the box." But he doesn't have that. Yeah, if you go, if you go down in the box, where well, that one, I said that when we watched it as well, and I said, "Why aren't these players just going down? Like, just take, take, take it." Yeah. What's the worst that can happen? He says, "No, it's not a fucking, it's not a foul. Mm -hmm. It's it is what it is." And um, but. It, if you want to go for the penalty, go for the penalty. Yeah. Then I believe there's nothing wrong with it. There's nothing wrong with it. Mm -hmm. So yeah, we agree it is a penalty. Others might yeah. not, but the game's over. Yeah. It's done. You know, is what it is. Uh, what do you think about yeah. Grealish today? Looking good. Yeah, Grealish was very, very, very good. Um, well, the whole Villa team were good, but he shone out for me a lot. Yeah. The um. He, he, he can make a, a shit situation look really good like the Ollie Watkins there was I couldn't see anything there until he until he did that little little sweet cross that De Gea saved in the end yeah but like it doesn't look like anything's happening but Grealish can make some magic happen out of anywhere it looks like yeah yeah no he's very good and I know United are looking at him and I'd love to have Grealish for us don't think it'll happen don't think it'll happen I don't want to see it happen uh, so that win for United puts them joint top with Liverpool. Well, second, but goal difference. Like we were saying earlier, goal, goal difference doesn't matter till the yeah, end. Yeah, no, goal difference doesn't, doesn't exist until the last day of the season, yeah. Yeah. But United being second this time um, is good. This time of the, of the season, it's unheard of really for the last however long. You don't expect to see United up there. No. But um, yeah, I, I, like, I like seeing... Any club that, that that do well, I like just good football, so I'm really happy with what's going on. Mm -hmm. But if you think about it, if we didn't beat Wolves and we didn't beat Villa, we wouldn't be in a title race. But we are. People will hate to admit it, we are in a title race now. We've won those two games. Yeah, I know, I know what you mean. It, I, it's hard to admit that you're in a title race, but you are. I don't Man think, I don't think definitely in the title run now. I don't think we'll win it. I don't think we quite have that quality yet. You can't. You can't say you don't because you don't. Well, you can't say they're not in the title run because they're joint top. Mm. Yeah, I, any, like, I know anything could happen. Could happen. I don't think they will win it. I don't think they'll win it either. But they're they're up there, mm -hmm. and you can't deny that they've they've been great. We said earlier. Oli, two months ago, was going to lose his job. Mm -hmm. He's now joint top of the Premier League. Yeah. You can't, you can't, fight, you can't argue that something here is happening and it's happening really well for them. I know, it's mad to think like a month, two months ago, Oli was going to lose his job and now we're yep. top of the table. And it's, it's just crazy. If you told me two months ago we'd be top of the table oh. just after You'd have snatched year, my hand up. Wouldn't, nah, never would have thought it. Especially after losing yeah, exactly. to Palace first game of the season. Nearly losing to Brighton, not playing well there. It's just like... And not really doing much in the transfer market. Mm -hmm. so it's like there was nothing really added. Cavani, but then like it, he's, he's, I expected him not to do well at all. Yeah. So it's like, because he's old. Yeah. We're well, not old. He's, he's a bit, he's older than his prime. So I didn't really expect much of him. Mm -hmm. But you're up there. You're up there. Can't argue it. But what I like is we're winning matches in different ways now. You look at the Southampton game, we're 2-0 down at half-time, we win 3-2. Same with West Ham, 1-0 oh, down, God. win 3-1. And then we get a game like Wolves, where we're 0-0 yeah. to the 93rd minute and we get a last-minute winner. You get a game like today, where we're up yeah, at half-time and we, we, we snatch the win. And it's all these different ways of winning are just going to build the confidence to our team. But then uh, games like the Wolves game is a free game because like you were the better team mm -hmm. for the whole 90 minutes. But then it was like an undeserved goal in the 94th, 3rd, 4th minute. But you deserve to be ahead before that happened. Yeah. So, in a way, the points you deserve the points anyway, but it looks 
worse than it was. And today, you were the better team all game. Mm -hmm. It was a bit back and forth. But like the stats show, you had seventy, nearly seventy percent possession, twice the amount of attempts on goal. Yeah, but only win by one goal, so it looks like you're struggling. But even when United play bad, they're still winning. Yeah. So that that's a big, that's big a very bonus. Very good sign. Very good sign. Uh, I just thought Villa looked very good on the counter attack today. Yeah, no, they did. But that's all they've got. That's yeah. all they had. And they've got no depth they in the squad. Got, that's exactly what I was going to say. They haven't got mm. enough. They haven't got the stopping power in them to stay just fighting at the goal. Like, look at their bench. It's not good enough. No. Nowhere near good enough. But You're they're doing it wrong. They're it's better than it was last season. Yeah, yeah. But their starting squad is good enough. Mm -hmm. But then there's nothing else. There was a stat earlier when we were watching it that John McGinn has played every single minute of this Premier League. Mm. You shouldn't be doing that at this level. That's a lot. That's a lot of football. Yeah. It just shows but, there's, and there's, no depth. No one to, there's no depth. There's no one to replace him. There's no one good enough in their squad to then give him ten minutes off. Give, don't like maybe he, he don't start the second half. Yeah. But there's not. They haven't got anyone good enough to replace him. No. Yeah. I think. I think Dean Smith's made a very good start with the recruitment this summer. Just gone. I think Ollie Watkins, yeah. Matty Cash, Martinez especially. Very good bars. Well, yeah, Martinez big time. Ollie Watkins is a is a hard one really. Because he, he, he started off the season really well. He was overpriced, I believe. Mm -hmm. But then he proved he was worth that money. But now he hasn't really... It's just He's just the most unluckiest player in the world. Yeah. Like I was saying earlier, like, I just feel sorry for him. He, like, he, he takes on the keeper, shoots, there's a player on the line. Mm -hmm. He lobs the keeper, it hits the post, he scores, he's like, his little finger is offside. He, he, just, he just can't catch it. Fucking break. He's, he's had so many he, chances. It's just yeah. not going his way, is it? No, but it is. But like, there's like the little things. Like, it's just unlucky. Yeah, yeah. Everything. Yeah, but Martinez cracking. Oh, he made some great saves today. Uh -huh. Yeah, very good. I like Martinez. Yeah, I can't remember who did that shot. I think it was Bruno when he flipped onto the yeah. bar. Yeah, yeah. That was the end of the second half, wasn't it? Near the end of the game. Yeah. That was a great shot from Bruno and a great yeah. save. Save of the game has to go to Tejo with that hook. Uh, I, I probably yeah because it would have changed the game big time if that happened. Yeah, I think it just looked more fancy than it actually was. I feel like uh, when a save looks fancy, good. it's good. <laughs> if um, well, he was he was right in front of the keeper, so he didn't have much to 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 do. Not not much to do. I mean, he didn't have a lot to work with. It's either hook it or it's going in. Yeah. So. Yeah, maybe maybe that's save the save of the game because because of the importance of the save. Yeah, like you said, it could have changed the whole game. Yeah. Well, Man United get the win, and they are joint top of the table with Liverpool. Liverpool are only above us on goal difference, and I'm sure all the Liverpool fans would be reminding me, "Oh, we're still top. We're on goal difference." <laughs> but I'll take a joint top just after New Year. Um, if you looked at it a couple of weeks ago, we'd, I never thought we'd be there. Yeah. So, yeah, very good game of football. Thank you for watching. See you later.